Hi there guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Jake, you're here for another reaction. And today, I'm here with Season 1, Episode 3 of Ahsoka. Now, I've only just realised my hair looks like it's a wig. Do you know those, like, olden... Olden day wigs? <laughs> See, those, days, those wigs from the 80s. <laughs> oh no, I can't let people think I have a wig. Oh. Okay, in the meantime, whilst I'm trying to, like, I'm gonna, you, I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna sort this out in the, uh, sorry, my, my camera's going back. I'm gonna, oh my god, that's awful, I need to swear. I'm gonna swear I went in between this and the episode. Um, yeah, where we left off last week, um, Ahsoka's on her way to get bail on and, and all, and the witches, the, the wicked whist, uh, whist, wicked witch of, of the bunch, I don't care, I don't know, I, I, I the, this wig thing is throwing me off. Yeah, so this is on the way. We've got now uh, Sabine now, who's cut her hair and she's Padawan again, ready for action. You know, he had uh, Huang and Ned like being able to just sort of be like, "Come on, mate!" Like you know, it's your so this lightsaber. Take, take what is rightfully yours. That sort of thing. Um, yeah, we had a great sort of scene to show the Empire. No matter what, they still they just, you just they're just there. They just won't fuck off, will they? Oh, but yeah, I'm. Um, yeah, so we got we had that. That's better. That, that, I think, oh, listen, good episode. Really enjoyed it. I'm I'm here for the next episode. I'm going to jump into it because mainly I need to fix this, but also I'm excited. So I am going to jump into this guy. So I hope I enjoy this episode. And I hope you enjoy this reaction. And if you do, drop a like, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell. That would be super. But other than that, I'll see you on the other side. Quick, someone get a hairbrush. Just like that, I look rather reasonable. Oh, you're so sexy. <laughs> I'm such a dork. A few moments later. Saying it now looks greasy. I just can't win. I just gotta come to conclusion, like, just come, just accept the fact that I'm fuck ugly. He's fuck ugly. Yeah, fuck that droid! This droid came here from Corellia. Should have shared his fucking head off. Don't care what anyone says. That's it. That's it, Chopper. We got a <laughs> Still cute, that. Oh, here he is. Yeah, that's it. That's it, Daddy O. Show up. Oh, he's he's the dog's bollocks, mate. I like the fact he's just using torches as well. It's been a while. <laughs> you bitch! I see you still remember the basics. Enough to get by. Mm, barely. <laughs> the Yang, let's try something else. <laughs> How about Zatu Hu Yang? Yes. Hu Yang. I need to remember something called Huang. It's Hu Yang. Hu Yang. The weapon comes from Dr. Hu Yang. That's what I need to call him. Those skills will discover that according to Hu Yang, I'm the worst candidate to be a Jedi <laughs> out of every Jedi he's ever known. You told her that? It's true. <laughs> He's such a bitch. It doesn't matter. I think it does. Agree. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, he's got to stop it. He needs to calm down. Can't just be him shitting on her this entire episode. <laughs> I can't see. How am I supposed to fight? That's the point. Feel it. I want you to see with more than just your eyes. Next to Hu Yang. Are you sure? Ah, she. She's gonna be behind you. She's gonna be behind you. Actually, no, not. <laughs> You're panicking. Okay, here we go. That's fair. Oh shit! Hello. Oh hello. <laughs> yes. She's learning, baby. Ah. That was shitty. I mean, you're teaching, I get it, but that was shitty. Let's go again. Do you know what's good as well? There is that she. Yeah, thank you for the intro. The the. Uh, yeah, what what's good about it is that she wasn't sadistic about it. She's a good leader. Uh, to, well, leader, teacher, a master in that sense that she's uh, time to fly. <laughs> Oh, yeah, in that sense that she can, she's calm about it, she's not trying, she's not just, again, smacking her constantly, it is the light taps, 
obviously humiliated her by putting on the floor there, but it's just her and Hu Yang. Chancellor Mothma, Senators. Tara. Hello. Hello. Hello, Hello, you. Fine, Chancellor. In fact, we have former Imperials working throughout every level of the new Republic government, and they have all taken an oath of loyalty. Uh, it's things like that, just the Empire. yeah. Like the kind of loyalty. It, it, it's just, this is just. This is okay. I know I keep saying this is why shit happens. I get it, but like to be imagine be so blind into people being so. To imagine having a way of life and thinking a certain way, and then being like, "This is what I believe in," and this is what I believe in. It's in like so much so that like I'm obsessed with it. To to then being in a position of power where you can get whatever you want. It, people don't give up power easy, and if they when they do, they they yearn for it you know they want to go a lot of them they will want to go back to and that's what winds me up that these ignorant rich fucks are just there going oh well you know like you know they promise these things like it's just like how stupid can you be winds me up no be honest isn't this just another attempt to gain new republic resources oh you bitch this is Fine, okay, maybe right, but still. But still, he's he's still being a bitch. Were you ever in the war, Senator? Look him. Look what he's wearing. Of course, he was never in the fucking war. Ugh. Just sat back and waited to see who came out on top. <laughs> oh, delicious. The people of that republic, and I can tell you. He's an ugly fuck. <laughs> You act like we have a choice. I see no enemy. The Imperial fleet is scattered and broken. They have no I need to... Again, this is what I get. Maybe I'm talking in hindsight. But how can they... You can't get rid of an idea. You can't. You... This is why they keep coming back. It's why. No centralized... Allow me a moment to speak with my colleagues. <laughs> She's going to go away and he's still going to be a fucking bitch, that guy. Any money. Chancellor. Mom, is it true Aunt Sabine is going to be a Jedi? Now, where did you hear that? Chopper told me. Hey, yeah. um... I'm not... Star Wars would be what I want, but genetically, this child has to be adopted. Unless all is green from her went into his hair. Just saying. You did well today. See, praise... Praise. Well, that's that's what gets people there. Weapons I can handle it. I was hoping that the urgency of our situation could speed things along. That's 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 not how it works. Well, it works in a lot of films and television shows like that. I know. I don't feel it. The series is ending with her feeling the force. It's good. Uh, just, yep, there we go. Exactly. Predicted it. That's how it works. Even you, discipline. I mean, it's nice to still be teacher, kind of still slightly showing off. Although that was the simplest... That's yeah, that's the simplest thing that you could probably start with. It still seemed quite heavy for Ahsoka to do as well. Ahsoka. Historically, there have been very few Mandalorians who ever became a Jedi. Uh, <laughs> no. I need her to be herself. But you can be a Jedi that becomes a Mandalorian. I can I can assure you that me, I can assure you that me and everyone else that's out there in the world has tried to do this a million times. I still in the in my thirties now and again go, what if I actually can unlock power like this? And I'll still sometimes attempt. It's sad, it's sad as fuck, but you never know, you never know. And neither will the fleet. Of course, it what? fucking won't. Standard Jedi mission protocol when approaching an unknown situation in order to avoid enemy surveillance. He's still doing this? <laughs> right. right. In any. That's what I'm talking about. More of these shots. More of these. She looked like she should have hit that engine. That was way too close. Anything yet? On the object, no. However, I have several thoughts on everything else. 
He <laughs> Yang is such a he's he's the droid destroyed. There we go. Teamwork. Teamwork. I was about to say, they're, they're actually, let me pause here, because they actually are playing on the fact that not everything has to be blown up so quickly. Like, in a lot of Star Wars stuff, it's just like, I've got three chasing me. Oh, let me take out these two real quick. A lot of them, a lot of Star Wars stuff. This one's like, it's literally just been in this three for the past three minutes. And they're missing, and it is like they're taking a moment to still miss, but they're still attempting. So it's not like a, right, we're gonna do it my way, like on my signal. Bam, we did it. We, yeah, it's what happens when we work together, teamwork. Yeah, it's like a, right, come on, let's let's keep going, and we will eventually do this. I I, I am liking this. And we got one. There we go. Would be awkward in that moment. You, yeah. Ooh, you nice. But in that moment, a moment you got Port and Starboard mixed up. <laughs> so you feel like such an idiot. Oh God, he's saying that like he's. <laughs> but also, um, it's one of those things that it feels like he's going to go, oh my god, I know what, the, what it is, what the thing is, and then they're going to get separated and we're going to take a while to find out. Got this feeling, hope I'm wrong. Scan complete. There we go. And here we go. He's fried. They're fried, he's fried. They won't know what the scan is. Well done, Jake. Congratulations. You almost got them. <laughs> <laughs> you sassy bitch. And you sassy witch. Work fast. I'm going out there. Out there? Out where? Just keep working. I'll distract them. Out there? I've got an idea. She's going Guardians 2. Going to Galaxy 2. Where Drax decides to jump out of the spaceship LG with a gun. Oh my god, am I right? What? Fucking hell! Is... What? How? How? I don't want to say where the science is it is, but at the same time, where's the science in all this? Has she got grav boots on or something? Shut the fuck, Ahsoka! Oh. Ahsoka. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? What is this? Yeah. Yeah, grab boots. There we go. Okay, at least we got something there. That's fine. Thought was much, but just he wanted confirmation. What was it? What was it? Are these. Alright. <laughs> Are these the space whales? Are these the fucking cute? Oh. These are the space whales that. Okay, firstly, are they not the space whales we saw? Was it in Book of Boba Fett or was it? Uh, oh, it might have been. Um, no, no, no. I was doing my recordings by then, so I think it might have been The Mandalorian season three, when they're going through space. Um, are those are space whales. You would shit it. You would absolutely shit it being along. I don't care what anyone says. Look at that. Oh, that's close. That's too close to comfort. I feel I feel weird about that. Imagine getting lose them in a bloody sea of whales. And he's back. What are the chances? <laughs> and whales. Ah, yes. Standard operating procedure. No one gonna mention the whales? 
Shut the power down. I protest. I have a lot of work to do. <laughs> I suppose that's true. Shutting down. But now they're on ground level, I've got this fear that something on ground level is just going to go for them now. <clears throat> Thank you. <laughs> right. What was the scan? What was the scan? Can we stop turning them off? I haven't seen those creatures since the day Ezra disappeared. Oh, that's why it's a big... <laughs> this is guy not knowing shit. Anything interesting? In speak of intergalactic hyperspace lanes between galaxies, which used to follow the migration paths of star whales named... Pur there we go, star whales... Purgal! I'm not, I'm writing those names, because I need... <laughs> right, Purgal, because I want to remember this. Respect their gorgeous names. But... That is somewhat like, oh, okay, sorry, Doctor Who nerd. Somewhat like season five of Doctor Who, episode two. Uh, it's the Space Whale episode. I can't remember what it's called now. Um, it might have just been Space Whale. Um, but I don't think it was. Um, it's that that's for how humanities were able to... Uh, they used to travel the galaxy, the space wells and that, and they basically would just, they were their last hope. They used to travel across the stairs, and that's how they hitched the ride on, uh, they built a city on the space wells back. Just, that's, uh, yeah, just, yeah. Like the ones we just saw. Really? When? <laughs> you have a lot to catch up on, buddy. The Jedi have taken refuge in the forest. Retrieve them. them. Kill them. Stuff. Classic. Next episode's just going to be us contained in the forest now. Just them trying to kill us. Us like I'm there. But we're just going to fook them up. It's the end of the episode, isn't it? I've got a feeling. Yep. <sighs> Bastards. And that, guys, was my reaction to... Season 1, Episode 3 of Ahsoka. Um, good episode. Enjoyable. Less progression of the story in the sense that they gave us an episode where it was progression of the characters. Um, so obviously you had more... Which could, in the end, you could say story, couldn't you, anyway? But yeah, you got more to do with Ahsoka trying to teach, you know... Oh, my camera's been an absolute bitch. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, so... Ahsoka trying to teach Ren um, as, uh, like, her trying to keep her up on a... Well... Sabine, isn't it? So, God, maybe probably put respect to her name, of course, Sabine. Um, but yeah, getting more uh, to, to, to teach her the ways of the Jedi, like to be actually more in touch with it. I do think at the end of the series, we're going to get more, uh, like some form of you, her using the Force. Um, I feel like I will do it. If they don't, then it's like, fair enough. I, I actually respect them more if they do that. But they, yeah, just got this more than likely they will now. But yeah, no, I, I, I thought that was, I enjoyed, I thought that, I enjoyed that bit of it. Put a bit more. It doesn't have to all just be, well, Star Wars, Star Wars in the sense of like spaceship fights and things like that. And then we got a spaceship fight anyway. So, yeah, again, it's short, concise this episode. Whether it's going to be like this going forward, I don't know. I feel like obviously they have a lot of money pumped into these things, and I get it, but I don't know if longer episodes rather than spread them may help. But then again, who knows? I don't know, right now this might be a nice break before shit hits the fan and I'm like, oh my god, I want short episodes, stop it! So, we'll have to see. But otherwise, I, I enjoyed the episode. I wouldn't say, I I think I enjoyed the other ones, I, I'm fairly certain. But yeah, I I, I quite, I, I still enjoy this one. I, I, it's hard to make, it, it's it's hard to make me be like, this is terrible, you know? There's usually redeeming factors with a lot of things for me. But yeah, but this was still good. So this was redeemed. Uh, but I'll, I'll go through my notes real quick, because, you know, I want to. Um, yeah, I put trainer montage. So, so it was great. Slow injury. It wasn't just like a, it's going to be, oh, you've got this straight away. It was like a, she started to believe in herself. Started to actually, it showed her like being like, eh. but then again, she'll still get fucked up at points, you know? So I like the fact that it was, it was that. And she's willing to learn. You've seen that she's willing to learn. You, that's what she did. She, that's what they said in the episodes that you need, she'll, They'll know when they're ready, and you, and, you, well, and like you'll know when you're ready to do it. And they'll want, they need to want to do it. And she was ready to want to do it. And that's all you get. And is that she's still trying. She's she's just impatient, and that's what she needs to do is calm down. Like you know, uh, on that. But camera, thank you. 
Um, so yeah. So yeah, so I, I did enjoy that. Although it would have been great if we got like a Rocky montage or a montage you would have got on South Park or something like that. Something ridiculous. Like, Gonna need a montage. Ooh, even Rocky had a montage. Montage. Um, if you don't know what I'm on about, then you that's just probably the most random thing I've ever done in my life. I'm putting a clip here. If I don't put a clip here, it's because I'm lazy. I'm more than likely lazy. Anyway, moving on. Um, I put it down. Chan uh, Chancellor's annoying because obviously we got we had the turn the uh, the return of uh, of the Queen. Well, Queen, but we did have uh, we did we did get her back, and it's like it's like I thought I left that behind me. You know, like I thought I was going to escape bureauc bure bureaucracy and ass wipes <laughs> in this one, and I haven't. You know, it's just it's just. Hold the phone. Sorry about that. Yeah. I thought I was going to say, but then of course, as soon as I saw Mon Mothra, I, I should have realistically just been like, something's going to wind me up here. And it is, it is that whole thing. I, like, you know, I know people that love that sort of like the Game of Thrones, the sort of snideness of like, a, I know people that, that who like to, like the game of chess that is playing it like that for power. And plays, and I just, I, I personally don't like it. That probably just speaks for me and my t intelligence. I'm just like, smashy, smash, smash, you know? But, yeah, I just should have known I was going to get that. But good on Hera Her just for calling them out on his shit. Don't get me wrong, there was no fleet because why? Because she called him out on his shit. You just know that. But that's what this all was. This is what it all was. This is, this is what's infuriating, is that there's too many people just... Being too many cooks in the kitchen, too many people being paid off, too many things, and it's and it's just. <sighs> but again, here calling her out to being like, did you just check to see who out was going to come out like come out on top? Love that, love that about her and her adopted kid. Uh, well, I say okay, that's what she assumes is adopting. Could be biologically her kid. I don't know, but he's just popped up out of nowhere. I don't remember saying in the previous episodes unless she did just say Jason, and I was just like, oh, that must be someone I. I must know, and that was actually her kid. I don't know, but yeah, that I think we're gonna get more to that. That was just a weird thing to sprinkle in, you know, because like she's done a technically she's on a warship, isn't she? So, isn't she? I'm pretty, yeah, it's a warship. So, you know, not a good place to have a child, but anyway, that's what it is. Um, I like that. That I like the fact that it's like a not you can be a Jedi, a Jedi, but not everyone can yield the Force. You know, it's like a Wield, yield, no, wield, wield the force is probably the best way. No, everyone can be in touch with it, and there's ones that, like, I like the fact she said it's talent. Well, one of them is talent. Some people are more talented than the others. Like, it's just how it is. It's just what happens for most things. It's not a guarantee. And that's what was, yeah, and that's why I like that. It's like, not everyone can wield it. So you might just be, and like, uh, Hu Yang said, is that it's rare that a Mandalorian is the one that would, you know, can be a Jedi, like, can be a Jedi. And, but, Again, it's that it's the it's the wanting to try it as well. That's what you're saying. Is that the the need to see if you can get in touch with her? And she is, and yeah, I just uh, I I did it. I did enjoy that. It was like a don't get frustrated. It can take time, and I thought it was great. Um, I did like the who uh, who young's uh, comment about like you, you could you've come from it was it a long line of uncon uh, unconventional Jedi. So I do <laughs> I do uh, I do enjoy that. Uh, I just assumed she was on about her master. I assumed that he was, she was on about his master and his master before him. That's what I assumed. But then again, he'd just be shitting on her family for like, <laughs> like her actual family. I don't know. But that's what I took from that at least. Um, did enjoy that line. Uh, then we got the, listen, I put then flight fight. Now, then this is where it kind of went like, uh, I don't know. This is where, even though it was good, I enjoyed the fact that it wasn't like a, let's just, oh, we're going to get battered or, Oh, we're getting battered. Well, we have to work as a team. And then we work as a team immediately. It's like, yeah, we did it. They had to work for it. They did work for it. And it was like, it's a, it wasn't just for, you know, uh, Sabine to trust him, uh, to, 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 to trust Ahsoka. So Ahsoka then had to then be like, right, let me relinquish for, uh, control here. And let me actually give the pair to you so that we can work together, you know? I, 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 I did enjoy that, but I thought I just feel like, I don't know, man. I, I, I feel like there was something missing from it. I don't know whether it was more, either more fights or if it needed... I, I don't know. 
somewhat enjoyable at points that that fight scene, but it was like mm, I, uh, it fell flat, and I needed something else. Whether whatever the hell that else is, I have no idea. But I just needed something else personally for me. Um. So yeah. Um. But then obviously then. <laughs> Yeah, no, I, you know what, I was there wondering what else was in. Ahsoka on that wing was weird. That was, okay, now, I I, I don't know, I, I slightly enjoyed it because it's like, okay, it's okay, okay, literally jumped up to the end, decided to cut off like one of the fucking ship's wings and it's like, okay, 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 okay. But at the same time, it's like a, is this, is this, is this, is this going a bit too far? <laughs> is this, should, should realistically we be doing this? Like, should we put so I was finding that maybe that's why I'm a little bit sort of because eh, I'm stuck in that sort of just because you can should you but I don't know man I am um, that was weird that was weird and I, and I think I need to sort of like rewatch it again and just sort of be in the moment again but then sort of think about whether I how, how I feel about that because I'm torn between it being like a but then also so you've just Got an out, got an out in space, and you've chopped off a wing whilst doing it. It's, it, it's, it's. I, I don't think there's gonna be an in between. I'm either gonna be like, nah, I don't like it, or like, this is the best thing ever. But yeah, that was that was a that was an interesting one. Um, and then obviously then you have an Hu Yang. I'm gonna. Do you know what? I think that's the only way I can remember how to pronounce it. I have to really pronounce the Hu Yang. So Hu Yang, uh, him being obviously trying to work out, need to get a little bit closer. My God, I've got it. And then you knew he was, he was, he was out for, he was out of commission for a bit. I thought that they were going to be sort of like, they were going to get separated or something like that. And you know, they know, but they've just, it was just out of commission for about five minutes. Um, yeah, the whole thing to do with Wales. No, I think that's great. I think the idea of it concept wise is great. Star Wars wise, as well as also Doctor Who wise. I did talk about that. I think the concept of my fab, Fantastic. I definitely said fantastic, but I I really enjoy them. I th think they're such ugly looking things. Those ones, but again, I space whales, mate. Space whales, love it. Absolutely, absolutely love it. And the fact that they could be the ones that because they're sheer mass, they can travel across the galaxies. It's 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 a sensational con concept and. I'm here for it. And I like the fact that that's the reason why they knew they had to go to this point in space where they gathered so because they know that there's a there's some sort of factor in deep space travel there that they can use to be able to get to the other side. Um, yeah, I think it's great. And also since Ezra died. So um, they, they said that whether that's because they had a fight where the whales were there or they happened to be in a place where then Ezra got sent to the other, another galaxy as well, a neighbouring galaxy. But... <laughs> Um, but yeah, I do. I do like the idea that is the whole sort of hyperspace. Uh, that that that's the reason why they built the ship just direct and like specifically so they can travel to the other galaxy. So it'll be interested to see where that where that goes now. I I whether they travel there, I think they will. I personally think they will. But whether they travel there is is or whether they bring through to them, I don't know. But I think I'd like the idea of them going to a neighboring galaxy. You know, really. That'll be that'll be cool. I I want them to go real Rick and Morty weird though, like abstract, weird, strange as fuck. But I don't think they will. Like stranger than this, you know, <laughs> you know. Um, but yeah, but like I said, I feel like next episode is gonna be them trying to get out of the woods, get to the place where they find out where the coordinates are. How they get to the, I whether they're able to get onto the ship for them to travel with, I don't know. Whether they, the other people travel there in that ring ship with the you know. Yeah, where they get there and then they're left behind and then somehow they travel there on some space whales. You know, that'll be that'll be epic. The idea of it sounds epic, but then again, I'm not like the, the her on the ship doing the flips and shit. Uh, I'd have to... I've <laughs> seen them ride a space whale through space and time. Like, like I don't know whether... I, the idea of it, sure, I'm like, yeah, fuck it, where are But then seeing it, I'm like, oh, that's not what I want to see. <laughs> but I think the next episode will be them just sort of dealing with Again, the people in the forest trying to kill them, and they're just like, nah, mate, bam, 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 can't wait, can't wait. So, yeah, so I otherwise, overall enjoyed the episode. Um, and yeah, I, I think that, um, I think that, I, I hope next week's one they feel they deal with the claustrophobia, uh, claustrophobia, I guess, and the unknown terrain in the forest where we actually is. I don't want it to be like a 
a full on battle. I want them. To, I I wanted to use the terrain to their advantage and uh, both sides. Both sides. I wanted to just rather than just be like a yeah 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 we're here. I wanted to be like oh shit this is yeah quite like predator. I want predator. That's what I want. I want one of them. What either the Jedi or the baddies. Baddies. The bastards being being predator. That's basically what I want. But anyway, I'm going to leave it there, guys. Uh, overall, good episode. Enjoyed it. Uh, if you liked the video, please like the video. Comment down below what you think of this episode. What did I miss out? I know you're. I know you're down there, Walker. I know you are. Comment down below. <laughs> but uh, yeah, but what do you think of this episode? What have I missed out? Because I know, I know that I'm going to get it, which is great. Don't don't stop. I really enjoy them. I I, I like learning. So yeah. Well, but what do you enjoy about this episode? What was your favorite bit? What have you missed out? What have I missed out? All that sort of stuff without spoilers, like too much spoilers. I, I could like I could take some. Sp details that aren't really spoilers but kind of spoilers anyway comment down below let me know if you like this type of video subscribe to the channel hit the good notification bell get a notification every time i upload there's a bunch of other videos doing me reacting to star wars i've done obi-wan kenobi i've done mandalorian season three i've done um what else have i done oh my god well i've i've done oh my god well hold the phone what have i done hold on hold on i need to think about this I've done Andor. I've done Andor. That's right. So, um, and I feel like I've done a fourth. This this is my fourth one. I'm th I'm fairly certain. But yeah, just but as much as the Star Wars right here, the things that you're interested in to do with me. But I also react to other stuff to do with Marvel and random shit. But have a look around, and see what takes you fancy. I also do reactions to the Marvel, the MCU films actually with my mate Josh. Again, still haven't recorded the last film of the of uh, uh, Phase Three, which is Spider Man. But we got End Game and all that prior to that up. Have a look to see what takes you fancy. I also do reactions with my little brother Charlie to do with Doctor Who, New Who. We just watched one of the worst episodes of all time uh, in Tenants Era, Season 2, Love and Monsters. If you know, you know. If you don't, watch it. It's awful. But also watch the reaction because I like to think that's not awful, but it probably is as well. Anyway, <laughs> further than that, guys, I'll see you out there.